Good morning, Spruce Falcons. Thank you, fifth grade, for doing our Star Spangled Banner. This week is March, March 9th through the 13th. Let's go to kindergarten for the letter of the week. Hi, my name is Dallin, and I'm here with Rex and Israel from Mrs. Billy's class. Rex, can you tell me what letter you're holding? W. What sound does it make? Um, duh. What? Hi, well, Israel, what letter are you holding? J. What sound does it make? J. What's a letter, well, what's a word that starts with W? Watermelon and well. What's a word that starts with J, Israel? Jelly and jellyfish. Thank you, kindergarten. Now to our reporter for our story highlights. Hi, Mrs. Rev. Can you tell us about this month's CEO topic? Absolutely. This month's CEO project is responsibility. Can you tell me what's on the table? Yeah, so this is our project for this month. And so this month we're learning all about responsibility. Now responsibility has many different things that go with it. So responsibility is not only being responsible for a job, but it's also being responsible with the way with that you act. And so we need to be accountable for our actions. When we make a mistake, it's very important that we fix that mistake. And we also need to know what is expected of us so that we can do those things that we need to be responsible for. Now, for our project this month, each class has an egg that is unique, a unique color to them. And so these colors will go with the, um, with Mrs. like, this is, would be like Mrs. Allen's or, you know, one of the fifth grade classes. And inside of here is a little thing about responsibility. And so each, there's 12 of them, and you'll open them up, and there'll be a little quote or something to do in your class. And as you complete it, you'll write some little notes on the back if you want to, or you'll just kind of put it back inside, close it up, and then you'll bring it and drop it in our basket, which will be in the hallway down by the cafeteria. And our basket should be full by the end of the month. And that should do all these ways that we can be responsible and show responsibility. That sounds like a fun way to learn about responsibility. Thank you, Mrs. Rep. Thank you. Now for our Getting to Know You segment with Mrs. Brunson. Where'd you grow up? Well, I grew up in, in Utah. It's not the only place I've ever lived, but I grew up most of my life in Utah. Um, I started out in Nephi, little town um, down south, <clears throat> and then Salt Lake. That's cool. Where did you go to college? Oh, that's another long story. Okay, so I started at this little place called ITT Technical College, and I learned all kinds of stuff about computers. And then somewhere in the middle of that, I decided I wanted to be a teacher. So I went to University of Phoenix, and I really, really loved college. Um, so I kept on going. I went to Weber State and SUU, and I just made a career out of school. I love it. That's cool. <laughs> Where was your first teaching job? Um, a little school out in Magna called Copper Hills. I taught, I, I came into this teaching job in the middle of the school year with a class that was crazy. Um, they told me that, that they needed a really good teacher to come in and settle this class down in the middle of the year and it was kindergarten. So I, I did that and I did kindergarten for one more year and um, yeah, then I moved on. That sounds scary. <laughs> <laughs> How long have you been at Sprucewood? Um, 11 years since they moved from Jordan, since we switched from Jordan District. So 11 years, it's been a while. Who's your favorite Disney princess and why? <laughs> Um, I would have to say Cinderella just because <laughs> when I was growing up it was kind of close to my name and so I could pretend really easily that I was <laughs> Cinderella. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> Thank you Mrs. Brunson. You're welcome. Hi I'm Mrs. B here with Mrs. Gonzalez from Alta High School with Latinos, Latinos in Action. Can you tell me about the program? Yes, of course. So Latinos in Action is a service and leader ba leadership based class designed for Latino youth. You get to get prepared for college, learn leadership skills, and we are very involved with service in our community. Cool. How long have you been a part of Latinos in Action? 
I have been their advisor for the last two years, so I'm just getting into the program. But now that I've been here, it's been it's been a great experience. Cool. Can anyone from Spruce join you on you guys on Thursday? Anyone can be involved with us on Thursdays. Teachers send me names, and anyone who they send is who we work with. Great. Thank you. Thank you. Now for Sprucewood current events. Today, third grade is going to the Clark Planetarium and fifth grade has Discovery. Wednesday is Latinos in Action. Thursday, Chick-fil-A birthdays for May, June, and July. T-shirts and hoodie forms are due on Thursday. See you next week, Falcons.